Hey guys, how y'all doing? Doing pretty good. Well, <laughs> my last video I did, because you have to like, sometimes you know how you have to shake your camera if you're upright and you want to film, you don't want it filmed vertically? Well, that's what happened. <laughs> so my my first video came out vertical and that's just I guess not allowed <laughs> so I typed my canvas we're gonna get right to it what I'm doing is a controlled pour I guess that's what you would call it and then I'm gonna put glitter on it now if my light goes out let me make sure you're in view. Yeah, I ain't good. Okay. I will switch on my LED overhead light. Okay, because we don't want that happening. But it probably will. Because it's been overheating. I need to get a new camera. A new light. So that's okay if it runs off a little like that. It's going to run off anyway. Well, I'm going to stand up for this. Pale blue. You might be seeing my light too. I apologize for that if you are. And then I did the purple and then again gold and then I did turquoise okay Not very straight lines. The first time they were. Do you know that's always my luck? I just have the worst luck with technology. <laughs> you goofy boy. I don't know why I'm not doing it straight like I was the first time. Whoops. Oh, 
This one seems to be more more smaller this time. Thinner lines. I must have did them thicker the first the last time. So let's see what next. The purple. If by chance, you know, I think I, what I might do, if this light turns off before I get the glitter done, which is probably going to happen, I'll do a part two. Okay, guys? Be part two, controlled pour with glitter. But it's for some reason they overheat. It's not out of battery, it's not low in battery, just overheating. I am. Oh, yeah. oh, what did I do next? The purple. It's all going to get poured off anyway. That gold is. And then the turquoise. We'll do our turquoise, the final one, because I know that's going to get poured off. real quickly. Is there any air pockets in there? Oh, pretty. I really like it. The beautiness of it. Okay. So, what I watched someone do is they tip that first. And then sideways and this way and they went this way it looks a lot like my other one too but it's pretty neat except there's more black in this one so I'm hoping I can just Move that black out just a little. There we go. That's what I wanted. Okay, so good. I like it. It's pretty neat. Okay, so I'll get started on the glitter right away. Trying to find out a better way of sprinkling my glitter around. And what I have is a whole bunch of little glitters that you can order these from Amazon. A whole bunch, real cheap. I can't remember exactly how much, because I used to use them for my nails actually. I can't seem to grow my nails much anymore. 
with paint drying my cuticles out all the time. They keep breaking every time I do some hard work. So, okay. So, let me make sure it's in view. And what I'm going to do is turn it sideways so I know for sure you're getting a good look at it all. And I'm taking, I'm using the end of this pen thing. And what I do is I kind of, you know, make it go backwards on that. So it doesn't just come out in one big gob. There's my purple one. <laughs> you know what? It is easier having it turned for me. Hmm. Let me check and make sure you're still in view there. You are from the top, so we're good to go on that. Alright, we're just going to go at it that way. And I have some blue. This takes a while, that's why it's not that easy. I was going to try using my um, fingers. This time I forgot. Hmm. Some of these are the narrow ones, so they're hard. Let me just take off this glove here, see what happens. Oh, I just spilled a whole bunch of it there. It does work out good. No, nope, it's spilling when I stick my fingers in that little cup, but it does sprinkle better. And I'll have to use this little thing so I don't spill a lot. It does work better this way. It doesn't come out in clunks. Like this one was. I'm going to spread that a little. That's alright. And just touch side up with some glue real quick. Oh, that was black, but I can find blue. Don't want to take too long here with this. See, not the black. You won't be able to see the black. That's the thing about it is, that's what's a bummer is the cameras never give a picture justice. They really don't. Or videos. Okay, so there's plenty of black on there. Probably can't see it. I'll do this black. Cool. And then I'll use the turquoise color I have. It's 
So it's sort of like a between green and blue glitter. I don't do t uh, glitter too much. I always forget about it. Okay. Well, we have this one down here. Which you're probably not seeing right now, so give me a minute here. All right, so we got, oh no, we're going to go with the gold. This is beautiful. This is really pretty. I'm trying to think what it reminds me of. Just a little bit up there where it's faded into the turquoise there. It is so much easier with my fingers. A little bit up in here. Okay. Oh, a little bit right here. Okay. Now the purple. Did I do purple yet? No. Cool. Worked good this way. Let me work on this big blue one now. It's beautiful. Right on. I don't think I did this black. Actually, a few cells popping up there, which is surprising. Okay, now for the white, which is not going to be easy, but we'll make it work. I don't think I can do it with these long areas here. I'll put a little bit. <laughs> I'll put some right up in here. Sure, you cannot see the black and white. But it, when I do a close-up, you will. If my camera hangs in there that long. Okay, now a little blue here I missed. In the corner here. And I miss this blue. Let's see. Did I get that purple? Yeah, I did. Oh, blue right there. This is fun. And then that pale blue. Now, I think it's the last colors. I was lucky to have these colors. I used a lot of them in my nails. I had my nails growing real pretty.
let's see where else this is gonna be hard well, not right here this one um right here a little pale blue I can't get those are too small okay guys so what I'm gonna do is just zoom in that camera real quick so it's going to get a little dizzy for a minute. So I'm going to remove the camera. And I just moved my zoom. Come on, baby. Go back to normal. Nope. Okay. There she is. Let's see if you can see it from a side view. It's just beautiful. Okay. I'll touch up that corner there where the white is and I'll put a little bit of the color in there, okay? So I don't think, oh yeah, that was white. I need to put white there. I'll do that before the light shuts off. And the gold, pale blue, turquoise. Like I said, you just can't see it. The black, there you go. Like if you can see it maybe now. In the black. Oh, hold on. There, you see that black? Now I know you can't because the light's right next to it. There we go. Just can't see it in camera. So, once this dries, then I'll just kind of pat it a little. Shake off some of the extra... Um, if there is any extra glitter on it before I gloss it. So then I'll wait three weeks to gloss it. Pretty cool, I think. Fun technique. This is very pretty right over here. Except that corner needs white. Let me try to get some in my fingertip and put some on there. There we go. I'll probably change that color. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I just want to thank you guys again for all the subscribers. That has been um, showing up. I'm just really at awe over it every day. I look and it's just climbing and I'm just never expected that at all. Yeah, I hope you all are having a great day. I didn't know I didn't get a chance to say that to you. Because I was in a hurry before my light turned off on this video. <laughs> But I just want to thank you again for subscribing and stay awesome, stay smiling, and stay positive. Okay, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Bye-bye now.